Great cut by the vet, Markeith Morris. And a timeout will be taken here by Charlotte as the lead has ballooned back to 13 in favor of the Heat. Miami 95, Charlotte 82, 7.32 left in the fourth quarter. This is the Hornets basketball on Sports Radio FNZ and the Hornets Radio. I'm Will Kunkel with Fox 46 Sports. You got to join us every night for Charlotte Sports Live. This is the most in-depth, smart, and even funny sports show ever. We're also very humble. You're going to get fantastic interviews with the players, coaches, drivers, all the movers and shakers in the entire realm of sports, from the court to the field to the track. Get in on the game with CSL. Get all the news at 10, then the best sports talk on Charlotte Sports Live at 11, seven nights a week on Fox 46 Charlotte. Like a lot of women these days, Mackenzie Tudor knew exactly what she wanted in an engagement ring. I'm a big fan of Pinterest. I've been studying this for years. She wanted a pear-shaped diamond in a certain designer setting, but became frustrated quickly when most jewelers just didn't have it. You can go in a lot of diamond stores and they don't have the pear shape. They may have one option. They may have two if you're lucky. Then she and her boyfriend, Tim, found Diamonds Direct with one of the largest selections of loose diamonds in America in stock every day. Diamonds Direct had more than dozens of the exact size and shape of diamond that I was looking for. And because Diamonds Direct carries all the top bridal designer lines, names like Viraggio and Simon G, finding the ideal setting was just as easy. The styles at Diamonds Direct, they go right along with Pinterest. They are exactly what every girl's looking for. Diamonds Direct, the exact diamond you want, the designer ring you've been dreaming of. No compromise necessary. I can't say enough about how many compliments I get on my ring from Diamonds Direct every day. Diamonds Direct, your love, our passion. Official jeweler of the Carolina Panthers on Sharon Road. The grandfather clock is counting down to more than just a winner. Green, 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 roll sign, roll sign, roll sign. It's the final chance for a driver to make it to the championship four. Crash on the back straight away. And for a fan to catch all the drama. The bumper to the back of the 24. At the short track in NASCAR. With all three series on a survival path of a half a mile, it all comes down to Martinsville. And the whole family is invited to see the action. NASCAR comes to Martinsville Speedway, October 30th through 31st. Get your tickets at martinsvillespeedway.com. Plus the foul. You're listening to your home for Hornets basketball, the Hornets radio network. Hornets have had their bright spots in this one, trailing 95 to 82. They got it down to a six-point deficit at one point here in the fourth quarter, but Miami fighting back. They're now up by 13 with 7.32 left to go. Cody Martin, a career-best 15 points today. And from the three-point line, he continues to impress. Two of four today. He is shooting 50% from deep on the season. That's top 20 in the NBA. Of course, your leader in the NBA coming into today in three-point percentage is Jalen McDaniels. He was shooting 70%. But he's over two in this one. Still, he's above 50% on the season. 95 to 82, 732 left in regulation. The winner of this one will lead the division albeit very early in the season. This is just game number five for Miami, only the sixth for the Hornets. But you'll have a win in your back pocket against the division rival. And top spot on the totem pole at the end of business tonight. LaMelo Ball's back in the game. It's LaMelo, Miles Bridges, Cody Martin, Kelly Oubre Jr., and Gordon Hayward. LaMelo on the left wing gives to Hayward on the logo. Hayward back to LaMelo right side. LaMelo holds the dribble. LaMelo, 11 on the shot clock. One on one with Hero. Spins. Lost his footing. Throws it out to Miles Bridges near midcourt. Six on the shot clock. Bridges steps up. Fires a deep three. Too strong. Rebounded by Bam Adebayo. Rebound number 15. He can really put the pressure on the Hornets with a bucket here. Adebayo to Struz, fires a wing three, in and out, rebound Miles Bridges. Quick outlet to LaMelo Ball up the right side of the floor. LaMelo, had room for a three, puts the gun back in the holster. High post feed to Bridges, turns and faces against Hero. Bridges sweeps in, up with a left hand, and it nestles in. Miles Bridges now at 18 points. Charlotte down by 11. Now Hero, the runner on the other side, and a blocking foul is called on the Hornets, Cody Martin. Guilty of the infraction. That's his first. Tyler Hero to the line. Huge first half for Hero. He had 18 of his 21 prior to intermission.
Hero, an 84% free throw shooter. The first one is good. Hornets fans, be sure to download the DraftKings mobile app. DraftKings, the leader in daily fantasy sports and the official partner of your Charlotte Hornets. Jimmy Butler back in the game. He's got 24 points tonight. Hero. Sinks the boat. He's got 23. The Hornets trail by 13. 97 to 84 the score. 6.30 left to play. Gordon Hayward holds the dribble. Fires up a three. It's good again. Gordon Hayward drilling another Lowe's three-point shot. Puts it back to a 10-point deficit. 19 for Gordon Hayward. He's sunk five threes today. Crowd chanting, let's go Heat. Struce taps it back to Lowry. Lowry that takes the three, got Martin in the air. Now he jumps into him again. Got him in the air again, but missed the shot. Rebounded by Morris. Put back no, and this time Hayward skies and snares the rebound. Hayward in transition to Bridges. Bridges slows down. Long two on the way. No. Rebound tipped up and in by Gordon Hayward. And a timeout's taken by Miami as Hayward goes north of 20. He's got 21 today, and he's made it a single-digit deficit once more. Miami 97, Charlotte 89. He take the timeout with 5.47 left to go. Charlotte fighting to the bitter end. You don't get to 4-1 and one by accident, especially when you trailed at halftime in all but one of those contests. And the Hornets are showing no give up here. Really shooting the ball well from three. 13 of 34 on the game. That's 38% as a team. That's helping them bridge this gap that's been established thanks to Miami's superior rebounding there, outboarding the Hornets 53 to 34, a plus 19 advantage. Hornets fans, the Hornets fan shop has new and improved hours. And an outstanding selection as always at Spectrum Center. They're open Wednesday through Saturday, 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. For you to shop the latest and new and classic gear, or you can always shop from the comfort of your own home, 24-7, HornetsFanshop.com. Gordon Hayward has 21 points for Charlotte. Doing a lot of the damage since halftime. 14 of his 21 have come since intermission. He has made five threes in total tonight. He's got Charlotte down by just eight. It's Oubre, Martin, Hayward, Ball, and Bridges, the five on the floor. Lowry holding the rock for Miami as we're back underway. Lowry passes to Hero on the right side. Martin right with him. Hero downstairs to Adebayo. He'll rise and throw it down. Adebayo slipped the screen. And he's up to 22 points now. Hornets down by 10. Gordon Hayward. Gives to the high post to Miles Bridges. He'll face up against Adebayo. Runs right by him. Up with a right-handed finger roll. Yes, and one opportunity. Kyle Lowry saying he was set. He's asking for a challenge. He's saying it was a charge. Miles Bridges. Opportunity for a three-point play. Eric Spolstra discussing with his bench whether or not to challenge. Miles Bridges heading to the stripe. He will shoot the and one. 20 points once again for Miles, who's a 90% free throw shooter on the season. Two for two tonight, and this one rattles out. Still, Hornets back to a single digit deficit. Much better effort here in the second half. Struess, head fakes the three, drops it down to Adebayo, waits for the flyby from Ball and dunks it again. Someone is forgetting to cover. A gold medalist in Bam Adebayo. Hornets are down 10, 101 to 91. Hayward, head fakes the three, spins off of Butler, runs into the lane, gives off to Martin, who goes up for the left-handed flip. No, rebounded by Adebayo. Bam running the floor, gives to Butler on the wing. Butler into the lane, Butler to Hero. And it's tapped out of his hands. Last touch by Tyler Hero, Hornets ball. Quick inbound to Oubre. Oubre to Hayward. Hayward head fakes the three, drives baseline, throws to the corner, looking for Martin, who pulls it in. Gives it to Bridges on the wing. 
Bridges holding the dribble. Killer crossover. Keeps the dribble. Gets to the baseline. Spins up with a right hand. Missed it short. Rebounded by Bam Adebayo. 17 boards now for Bam. 4-13 left. Hornets. A couple of empty possessions. Trailing by 10. Butler. Number one defensive team in the NBA, the Miami Heat. And they get some offense here from Butler. Jimmy Butler's runner, his first point of the fourth quarter, he's got 26. Hornets have not been held under 100 at all this season. Been averaging 120, number one offense in the NBA, just 91 thus far. Bridges starts to drive, spins, head fake, kick out, Hayward. Head fake on the three, steps inside, long two, no. Rebound, Tyler Hero has it stolen away. Martin flips it backwards to Gordon Hayward, who goes up, poked out of his hands. Kyle Lowry, the deflection. Hornets ball on the baseline, trailing by 12. The timeout will be taken by Eric Spolstra and the Miami Heat. 331 left to play. Strong performance here from Gordon Hayward. 21 points. Miles Bridges not as efficient as he's been recently, but a very good scoring game. Lots of activity from the reigning Eastern Conference Player of the Week. He has 20 points. Charlotte trailing by a dozen. 331 left. See if they got one more run in them. Hornets fans, Spectrum Mobile is the best deal in mobile. You can get unlimited talk, text, and data for only $29.99. When you get two or more lines to switch and save up to 60%, visit SpectrumMobile.com. Heat 103, Hornets 91. Charlotte 4-1 thus far on the season, tied for first in the Eastern Conference. 